here, you can actually see that we have both a flat pad and a hole. The flat pad is for surface mount soldering key switch sockets. The hole is for uh, di direct soldering key switches, if you so chose. Everything absolutely ridiculous. There is now a train rolling through the station like absolute insanity. The big thing I don't know about key switch sockets is... Do I need to put an extra support thing under here? I think $200 can... Uh... Yeah, pretty much. OBS just refused... Lurk for the foods. Always, always lurk for the foods. This particular installer. a USB port on that guy. Oh, because I didn't update it at the global level, did I? I updated it at Um, I have not, Carrot. I have not linked the store to my account in ages. Uh, <laughs> I'm mostly streaming for myself here. <laughs> Rain um, what I might do is use the cover and bolt in through the bottom. I don't know yet. Doing all the cool, cool person things. Not terribly far off, though. <laughs> Carrot is the top and the uses to be tamed. Um, so the big thing I'm trying to figure out... Um, is... Did I put the QM3 through the bottom? And the annual, annual license, which is the affordable option, is like $2,000 per seat. Per year. And that's basic just straight normal modeling nothing else outside of that which is just unreasonably expensive so i've been looking around there's plenty of softwares out there headphones always worth looking to see if somebody else has done the work for you One moment. 
please. So we're gonna we're working our way through QMK. So we like it as a night bike. Yes. Yeah, so this is this is kind of where we're at. We've got some some pieces. We'll probably put some heat inserts there. Um, this is basically where we left off last time. Uh, since then, I haven't touched KeyCat, I haven't looked at the PCB, um, I have, however, that one? There it is. I have, however, started, you are definitely not innocent. Not innocent in the least. <sighs> okay. An installer should be done. Okay. Now I'm supposed to be able to go to... I don't remember which one we went with. So I'm going to have to go find it real quick. Post... Uh, CAD softwares have nowadays is the ability to output um, a step file or some other 3D modeling file format. Uh, what I've done with that is I've used that to project a set of holes onto the back, which then I've created these and I'm going to... I'm just going to grab a file real quick. While I'm waiting for that, uh, I'm just going to quickly download a file for uh... That's why if you look So, mostly just waiting for... It'll likely be some combination of using these holes to pass up through into the lid. I'm not certain yet. We will see. Um, maybe it'll be a case of using this hole for just holding the PCB down and then the other four for holding the whole package together perfect but it's what we've got kind of thing and that is the facts it's like yeah okay it's not perfect but it is made by volunteers great that's also fine the fact that it's made by volunteers does not change the fact that it, it could use improvement you know um bottom here is yeah that's why we uh, that prongs off of the board which I think is probably going to be there that's probably about as far forward as that's going to get um, and now we need to let's see. you absolutely told me about that already <laughs> I haven't done anything with that yet. Um, let me take a quick look here. So 
Thank you so much for the gift subs. Really appreciate that. Yeah, mom, you if you buy stuff from your from the mobile app, you pay a bunch of extra money for literally no reason. Absolutely no reason what the keyboard people do. Uh, because that is not me. <laughs> I do have a cool mom. Yeah, they are they are currently zipping around in their RV right now. Um, um, let me quickly flip windows here. Paid our connections up the back, uh, the back end here, because the USB-C is a reversible standard. If you don't do that, uh, you will not have a reversible USB-C connector, and then people would be very confused. This cookieless storm.